The NASCAR Monster Energy Cup Series will go to the Pocono Raceway in Long Pond, Pennsylvania on Sunday, June 11th for the 2017 Pocono 400. This race will be broadcast on Fox Sports 1. The Pocono 400 is the first of two Monster Energy Cup Series races of the season at Pocono Raceway. It was first run in 1982 when it was a 500-mile race. In 2012, it was taken down to 400 miles, and it seems to have gotten a great response from the drivers and the fans alike who felt the race was getting too long. Pocono Raceway opened up in 1971, and while it is a two and a half mile track, it is not a super speedway track like Talladega Super Speedway or Daytona International Speedway. It is more like the Indianapolis Motor Speedway in that it is a large track, but it is not as fast as Talladega and Daytona, and it is not shaped like an oval, but like a triangle, and in fact it has three turns. Turn one has 14 degrees of banking, while turn two is banked at nine degrees and is similar to the tunnel turn at Indianapolis. Turn three is banked at six degrees and is similar to the Milwaukee Mile, and it makes things very difficult to set up cars to be perfect through all three turns. Restrictor plates are not needed at Pocono, despite it being a two and a half mile track, and it is very wide as cars can go five wide through the turns, but some drivers say that Pocono is more like a road course. Brad Keselowski won the pole here last year, but he failed to even lead one lap. The race was won by Kurt Busch for his first win of the season, and he led 32 laps along the way. Next was Dale Earnhardt Jr., who was followed by Keselowski, Chase Elliott, who led a race high 51 laps, and Joey Logano. This race was postponed until Monday, as the rain would not cooperate with the NASCAR schedule on Sunday. Jeff Gordon leads the way here with four wins at the Pocono Spring Race, while a group of drivers have all won twice, including Bobby Allison, Tim Richmond, Terry Labonte, Jeremy Mayfield, Tony Stewart, Denny Hamlin, and Jimmy Johnson. Before Kurt Busch took the title last year, it was Martin Truex Jr. winning in 2015, Dale Earnhardt Jr. in 2014, Jimmy Johnson in 2013, and Joey Logano in 2012. Kyle Larson has been red hot in 2017 with three pole wins, one checkered flag, and he has led the most laps in a race twice following the first Talladega race of the season. He has an average finish of 8.0 in three starts in this race, finishing in the top 10 twice, and he finished 11th here last year. For our prediction, look for the number 42 to head to victory lane for this event. If you'd like to bet on motorsports, including NASCAR, IndyCar, Formula One, and more, there are two different ways to bet. You can bet on the outright winner of a race or the series, and you can bet on who will win each individual driver matchup. You can place a bet on the winner of a race by clicking on motorsports, then on NASCAR, IndyCar, or Formula One, then on futures or pick winner prior to the race, and there you will find a list of drivers to bet on. If a driver is listed at positive odds of, for example, plus 750, that means you could win $750 by placing a $100 wager on that driver. A positive sign usually indicates somewhat of an underdog, but rarely will you see any negative odds on a driver to win a race. If you do have a driver with a negative sign in front of their odds, for example, odds of minus 150, that means that they are a favorite to win and you would have to bet $150 on that driver to win 100. The second way to bet on motorsports is driver matchups between two drivers, where you only have to choose who will win the matchup between the two listed. Sometimes one driver may be favored over the other, indicated by negative odds, or the odds could be even on the drivers. You use the same rules as with the race winner and futures with plus and minus odds to calculate your payoff for each and every matchup. Subscribe now so you don't miss any of our NASCAR, Formula One, or IndyCar videos. And to get the updated betting odds video that will have our racing experts updated free picks and predictions. Click over now to check out all the motorsports odds on the board, including Formula One, NASCAR, IndyCar, and more. Make a few wages at BetDSI.com and enjoy the race.